All right, this is Blake Imison with Lime Cuda, and today we're going to go over how to upload a file, like a document or a PDF, to your WordPress dashboard, and then someone on the front of your WordPress site will be able to click that and download a file. So, uh, first, a little bit of philosophy. Right now, you've probably got a file. Uh, in this case, we'll just talk about a PDF. You've got a PDF and it lives on your website. It's local on your website. So what we need to do is we need to upload it to the server so someone else out on the internet, on the web, can access it. So first thing we do is we go here and we click Add Media. And we go Upload File, Select File, Browse and find the right PDF that you want to upload. And then we can come over here and we can just grab this URL or this URL right here, both should be the same. And a good gut check right now is just make sure the URL ends in .pdf or .doc or something like that, uh, which indicates you know the URL actually is to that specific file. So what we do is we copy that, X out of here, and then let's go find uh, the text that we want to highlight. So say for instance we wanted these words, if someone clicked it, for them to be able to download. All we would do is we'd highlight, come over here and click the link, insert and edit link button, and we paste in the URL that we had just copied, and again notice it ends in PDF, we click add link, and then if we update this, if someone clicked on that URL right there, they would go and be prompted to download that uh, PDF. Um, alternatively, if we click in another link and click insert and edit, it'll let us change the, um, the URL. So we could paste in a new URL if we wanted to update it. Um, you can also go here and click add media and you can find uh, old documents. Same rules apply. So you just click the one you want, go over here and you know select the link and then you would just copy and paste it into the, um, the new area. Some sites have a embed document again. We'll go real quick. If your site does not have an embed document plugin, then this won't apply because this is a um, plugin added on to WordPress. But you'll have a button like this that says "Add Document," and you click on it. And same kind of rules. You could upload a file or, you know, use a new file. All you do is you click Insert, and this will then give you some options like um, how wide and how tall, uh, if you want a download link to appear, uh, which viewer, we usually just do the Google Docs viewer, and then you click insert. So what this does is, if we save this real quick and just show you, this is going to embed the PDF in the page. Instead of it just being something you click a link and are prompted to download, now, if we go and view this page, the the document itself will show up, and you know you could change the height of the document and the width to fit your needs. Uh, but you know someone could just see the entire PDF here and scroll through it, highlight text, um, or they are prompted to download it right here. If they click this, uh, their computer will prompt them to download. Uh, this PDF that we just embedded. All right, hope this was helpful. If uh, you have any questions, just uh, send me an email. All right, thanks.